Yo, YouTube, what's cracking? It's your man, Mr. Fomer Simpson, back with another sneaker video. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook at Mr. Fomer Simpson, and all those links will be in the description. Now, first and foremost, I got to give a big thank you to Jeff Staple and his team, along with ZJ, for not only putting this contest together, but also picking me as a winner. Quick background for those who don't know, Jeff Staple, founder of Staple Design and Read Space, teamed up with ZJ, and they set up this Instagram contest where you had to post your staple outfit of the day. They picked 10 winners, each of which got a pair of these kicks. I was lucky enough to have my photo selected, and literally, I had these at my front door a few days later. And with that being said, let's take a look at these babies. Bang, bang, the Staple and ZJ LeBron 10 Pigeon Custom. These are Nike IDs with a few really dope details, and even though they are simple, these joints are straight up mean. For starters, you got the Robocop upper. Yo, Robocop was a bad dude. He had the crazy Cyclops helmet, the gun holster that popped out of his hamstring if he even sniffed trouble, ready for combat at all times. Smooth cocaine check on the front, and on the back you got the textured joint. And the dopest part of the shoe is this pigeon on the sides. This is one of the training day pigeons they used to flip when Denzel would roll up. I don't blame him, Denzel was on some other shit. Lurking in the black Monte Carlo, Jack Macy Gray with a takeout menu, dropped Hoyt off with the essays. He didn't care about Nathan besides getting that bread to pay off the Russians. On the other side, you got the ZJ logo. He was the customizer, obviously. Another nice touch. Pigeon coop vents on both sides, word to Mike Tyson. Gray Poupon mesh on most of the tongue. And then it turns into the pro combat up top with the brawny pull tab. White and gray laces, nice and clean. And you got the Mufasa lace lock, which is always classy. On that James Earl Jones, city and state please. You got this icicle along the side of the shoe with the concrete jungle midsole. Very nice, very nice. Orange is the new black interior, Piper Chapman stees. Leather face insoles, and as you can see, the staple pigeon in cahoots with ZJ for Bron Bron Bigelow. 360 zoom unit, you already know. Peep the little porcupine acupuncture needles. It feels like you're walking on clouds in these joints. Tropicana bottoms. Yo, I would always ask Mom Dukes to buy Tropicana back in the day. Always. Instead, she would get us the orange juice that you kept in the freezer and had to add water to make. It tasted like pure ass, but Moms would hit us with her favorite line. It's all the same stuff, just read the ingredients. Same thing she'd tell us when she'd bring home crispy rice instead of Rice Krispies. Overall, I really dig these. The LeBron 10 in general is a sick sneaker, and the details they added are just ill. These joints are definitely Dopra Winfrey. So that is it for the review. I hope you liked it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button as always. And if you are not already subscribed, go ahead and tap the subscribe button as well. I got some other videos on the way, so stay tuned for that. Not too much else to talk about. So until next time, Mr. Former Simpson, out.